Hello everyone, I'm Talha Kavuncu. I am a PhD student in Aerospace Engineering at the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign. I am excited to present our recent work on motion planning in multi-agent settings. To transform our lives, robots will no longer operate in isolation. It is expected that robots will have to interact with other agents. For instance, a delivery robot needs to interact with pedestrians, an autonomous car needs to share the road with human-driven cars, or a drone needs to interact with other drones to maintain a formation. However, it is often challenging to plan for robot actions in such interactive settings because agents' behaviors are coupled and the decisions of one agent affects the behaviors of other agents. It has been shown that multi-agent interactions can be modeled as games. In our formulation, we assume every agent has its own dynamics and its own cost function which is coupled with other agents. In such settings, interaction outcome is best represented by a Nash equilibrium. However, solving Nash equilibria for differential games is actually solving coupled optimal control problems. And because of this coupling, and also nonlinearities in system dynamics, finding a Nash equilibrium for a differential game is hard. In this work, we show that interactive trajectories can be found by solving a single optimal control problem instead of solving coupled optimal control problems. Our key insight is that under certain cost structures, game theoretic interactions become an instance of a potential game where using a potential function, we can solve a single optimal control problem to find the equilibrium of the game. Assume that every agent is optimizing a running cost L sub i over a horizon of time t and a terminal cost S sub i. If each agent's running cost and terminal cost can be expressed in terms of a function that is common to all agents and another cost term which depends only on the state and actions of all agents other than agent i, then it has been shown that the equilibrium of the game can be found by solving a single optimal control problem that minimizes the potential function over the time horizon t. Now we will see how the potential game formulation can be used in a multi-agent interactive setting. For instance, let's say we have three agents, each of which has its own cost function that consists of tracking costs that penalizes deviations from the reference trajectory and pairwise collision avoidance costs that penalize proximity between agent pairs. Our key insight is that if pairwise collision avoidance costs between the agents are symmetric, then the interaction is a potential game. In this example, this means that if agent 1 penalizes collisions with agent 2 in the same way that agent 2 penalizes collisions with agent 1, agent 1 penalizes collisions with agent 3 in the same way that agent 3 penalizes collisions with agent 1, and finally, agent 3 penalizes collisions with agent 2 the same way agent 2 penalizes collisions with agent 3, then the game is a potential game. In which case, we can write down the potential function P as the sum of the tracking cost of all agents plus the sum of the pairwise collision avoidance costs. Similarly, we can write down the terminal potential as the summation over the agent's terminal tracking costs. Now that we cast our interactive trajectory planning problem as a single player optimal control problem, we can use any existing trajectory optimization algorithm to solve for equilibrium of our game. In our work, we use the iterative LQR algorithm for its success in many robotics applications. We verified, a, we verified our approach in an inter intersection scenario involving three agents. Each agent tries to reach their goal while trying to avoid colliding with others. In our simulation studies with thousand randomized initial states, vehicles are able to avoid collisions and resolve conflicts. The quality of the trajectories found by our solver is as good as the state-of-the-art general game solver, but our solver is more than six times faster. To test our algorithm, we ran experiments involving two quad rollers. We ran a potential iterative LQR algorithm in a receding horizon fashion to generate waypoints that lead to collision-free trajectories. In our first experiment, quad rollers start at the same height and are commanded to exchange their positions with each other by following waypoints generated by our algorithm. In our second experiment, quad rollers are commanded to traverse diagonal trajectories that will lead to collisions in the junction. In both cases, our algorithm successfully generated collision-free trajectories that are highly intuitive. In summary, we have shown that by exploiting the cost structure, we can decouple some game theoretic interactions and find Nash equilibria by solving a single optimum control problem. As a result of this, we have obtained a more tractable and scalable algorithm compared to general game solvers. In the future, we hope to extend our approach to cases where agents do not need symmetric pairwise costs. We also hope to extend our approach to games with hard constraints. Thank you for listening. 
And if you have any questions, feel free to reach out using my email address.